Susan Page, why did you call your book The Matriarch? Because she was a matriarch. Who was she? She was uh, a funny, sharp, smart, caustic woman, uh, one of just two women to ever be both the wife and the mother of presidents, the only uh, person ever to live to see both her uh, spouse and her child uh, move into the White House. She was, uh, I think, someone Americans loved but didn't really understand. Uh, and I thought that deserved a story. And then I turned to the judge, and I talked about what it felt like as a young man to watch his friends gun down in front of him, two of them who died in my arms. I talked about what it felt like to be a mama's boy and watch my mom be violated in front of me and not be able to help her. I talked about how remorseful I was for the crime I committed. I talked about how much I learned since being away in prison, all my accomplishments, no infractions. But then I also talked about what I would do if she gave me a second chance, how I would commit my life to helping the other Christians of the world every single day. And then I remember saying, this was kind of bold, but I remember saying, even if you don't let me out, I'll go back to prison, I'll grow old, I'll keep mentoring people, because that's who I am. I was like, but you really should consider letting me out. And I remember the judge, she just stared at me for a while. It seemed like five minutes. And, and my family didn't show up for court or whatever. It was other people's family. Everyone was just leaning in, looking at the judge, looking at me. And like my heart was beating. I could see it beating through my shirt because she had my life in her hands. And she just stared at me. And she says, you know what, Mr. Wilson? You committed a terrible crime, but your accomplishments while away in prison were nothing short of amazing. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to give you a second chance to get out. But you can't be regular. You can't just get a job and fly under the radar and start a family. You wrote up all these ambitious things. You want to start a company. You want to travel the world. You want to create all these opportunities. You got to do everything on the list. And she says, you better not disappoint me. <laughs> <laughs>